So Eddie's just making up a little weapon here. I believe he's going to throw it to try and get a flying fox or a bat. Oh yeah, yeah, I can see it. Oh. Ooh. Woo! So this tree right here has got grapefruit on it, wild grapefruit. So while the boys are hunting the bats up there, I'm going to try and get some of these grapefruit down. Oh, I got it. Look at that. First shot. I got two grapefruits. I'm going to go collect some nuts now. And we're going to join in on the boys' hunt for the bats. If you want a bit more context of how remote I am here, Watch this video after this one. It's an absolute wild greeting to these beautiful islands and these beautiful people. For those that think this is a little bit strange or weird, literally on this island, there is no shops. There's no other way to get food. So these boys have to hunt from what's available. So a lot of it's off the land. There's lots of fruit, veg, birds, pigs, pigeons, bats and going along for the ride because otherwise we're going to starve. Sort of just winging it. Eddie doesn't speak much, much English, and I'm sort of just following his lead. It's been wild so far. Eddie, wait. See all these little dots here. I just figured out that they're bloody fire ants, and they are lighting me up. Oh, I'm so itchy, but it should go away in like an hour or so or something. <laughs> Every time that is the scariest thing, man. <laughs> Almost got him. <laughs> got one. Hold on. These right here are the uh, nuts that I got. I'm going to get into them a little bit later on, but we got to go see if we can get a bat before the sun goes down. You got one. <laughs> the boys just successively hunted a bat. It's not my thing, but it's their culture. They've been doing it forever, so taking it down the water. I'm just following. I don't really know what's going on. <laughs> what? This is actually wild. They've already 
skinned them and they put them on over the fire. Over here I've got all my nuts and stuff, so I'm gonna get into this, crack them open while the boys are probably gonna tuck into this. That fire is burning my legs off. This nut's good. That's the actual nut there that I'm gonna eat, and this one hasn't been developed enough yet. It's not ripe enough, so. Okay. Oh, that one here. Little one. That was an absolutely wild experience. Uh, the boys are legends. They're, they're good dudes and I can't thank them enough for letting me come on this experience. I think the best thing to take away from this is that everyone's culture is different, but it's beautiful and it's amazing and it should be celebrated. If they choose to eat what they want to eat, live how they want to live off the land and all that, if I want to eat fruit or live sustainably off the ocean, it's, it's, it's my choice, it's their choice and it's amazing. And uh, hopefully I showed you guys at home a bit of that. Party shirt. Party shirts. My way to say thank you to you guys for showing me around and stuff. So thank you. Other way. <laughs> you missed it. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> yeah. yeah. Thank you boys so much. Ooh. That's a wrap, baby. Yep. <laughs> <laughs>